What's up guys? Sailor is back and I'm in my mom's room because it has really good lighting, but I wanted to introduce this vlog. Thank you so much for the love on my last video and I'm excited for this next video. This is, video is going to be more of a vlog format. I leave for Michigan in like two weeks and actually two weeks starting Monday, I think. And I am actually seeing my friends for the last time tonight uh, because starting Monday I have like a two week quarantine that I'm going to do. Um, just to take all precautions um, to make sure that I don't bring any illness to campus and yeah and I take a, I'm gonna take a COVID test before I go and all that stuff so I'm gonna document preparing for college saying goodbye to my friends um, everything in between I'm getting my wisdom teeth out so that should be kind of funny to put in here and yeah so I really hope you enjoy this vlog and let's get started <laughs> also I wanted to show you guys um, some stuff that came into the mail today from Amazon for my dorm, so let's just get into that. Okay, so the first thing that came in the mail today was my art prints from Society6. Uh, I just bought like a ton of different ones. I'll give you guys a little sneak, sneak peek. Basically, I went with like a yellow theme because my roommate and me are going with like a yellow and white. So I just got like tons of like random art prints for my room and you guys will see those in full action once I move in and do like a dorm tour and all that stuff. But I got those. The next thing I got, which were way bigger than I expected, I thought they were gonna be like this big, are these bags. They're kind of huge and there's like a huge assortment of different sizes and the biggest one is kind of ridiculously huge. Like I'm not even sure why, but these are gonna be for like my laundry and I, I think you put like delicates in them and stuff. I don't really know. I have to look into that. But then I got these globe string lights. They're um, I'll insert a picture like right, right here. But they're um, like warm color, warm tone string lights and the little globes. And my roommate got the same ones, so we're gonna put those both in our room. This next thing, this is a like a power surge like extension cord with a ton of different um, like outlets on it. I'll insert a picture right here. But that's that, and apparently it's really important. So I got that too. And this last thing, this is a bedside shelf. <laughs> the bedside shelf. It's called a bed shelfie, I think. And um, saw it on Amazon, and it like connects to your bed on the side, and it just makes a little table for like your water and your phone and whatever else. And I'll insert a photo right there. But that's that, and that came today. Another thing that we'll see how it ends up getting back. So that's everything that came in the mail today for my dorm. And yeah, it was kind of an exciting day. So like college corner. It's not that much, but we have this, this, but I just removed it out. It has like tons of stuff I'm bringing to college, so. My grandma like made me these towels. They have like my initials on them. Ah! Initials on them and they also have like the Michigan M, you can't really see. My roommate has the same ones. I have like some decor, my bedding. And down here I have like some big coats I'm bringing. And also like some little decor and like tucks and all that stuff. Oh, and this is... This thing from Dormify is, it's basically like a picture holder. It like strings pictures on your walls, kind of like that. So yeah, this is my dorm corner and it's gonna get a lot bigger, but that's, that's it for now. <laughs> What's up guys? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> don't mind this. I got my wisdom teeth out recently, so I'm still icing and stuff. So don't mind it, but just gonna show you guys a before of everything. We're actually boxing a ton of stuff today and mailing it to Ann Arbor for the shipping service to have it delivered to my dorm because that's the struggle of an out-of-state student. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's just show you the before. There's a lot of the college stuff we have that we have to pack up and ship out tomorrow. Everything from towels to tons of bedding, dorm decor everywhere, all this stuff. So we have bins and boxes and we're gonna pack it all up and ship it off to Ann Arbor tomorrow. So let's watch it happen.
Hey guys, it's the next day and we're headed to the post office to ship off these four boxes. We actually made one more box because the last minute Amazon shipping came in. But yeah, this is the first step, woohoo! Okay, so we just dropped all the boxes off and it feels so good because that was a majority of all of the dorm stuff. And besides that, we have to pick up stuff when we get there, but moving to college across the country is definitely no easy feat, but I think that sh shipping was the way to go, so. How do you feel, Mom? I feel great! <laughs> Good morning guys, uh, it is a Monday which means we're almost inside of one week until we leave and get on the plane to Ann Arbor. But first, we meet, need to do something. University of Michigan partnered with a company to actually send all of the students coming to campus a COVID at home test and we're praying that it comes back negative because um, that video would be very short if, the <laughs> if it came back positive. Yeah. We have no swab, this thing that you put the swab in after you test, the thing that you put all of that into, and then I think maybe put it into here and then ship it in this. I don't really know. We'll see, but we're going to watch a video and know how to do it. Is it right on the TV? Yep. Okay. Okay, so up the nose an inch. Up the nose an inch. Are you doing it? No! Wait, why? why, why you can go up your own nose. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to use this first. post-covid test <laughs> I was having a pretty good day and then that covid test made me ball my eyes out that's okay <laughs> good riddance <laughs> all right so I'll see you guys on Friday when we get the results back it's gonna be a painful week of waiting this reminds me of college app season when you're just waiting and waiting for the email to come in there's no reason it should be positive but still this is what college prep is during a pandemic and you heard it here first <coughs> That is what I'm freaking talking about. Let's go. Ann Arbor, here I come. Woo! Good morning, guys. It is a Friday, and I believe the 21st, so that means four days until we get on the plane. It's a big day. We are going to be packing up a lot of my clothes and a lot of the stuff that we didn't fit in boxes um, that we also need to bring. So it's going to be an interesting process. Um, I'm kind of curious how we're gonna do that with like the fact that we have four days left and I'm gonna still need to wear some stuff. So we'll pack, but also leave out some stuff for me to wear, I guess, over the next four days. I'm so excited and yeah, let's just get into it. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna walk you guys through a little bit about how we're gonna do this. And disclaimer, um, I like in my house, I basically have all my clothes upstairs in my old room and then, um, this is tiny room in my house and then downstairs is where when we remodeled and made a new room for me so you'll see like two rooms and they're both mine technically but it's just because I live in like a hundred year old house and we didn't have room for a closet really downstairs so uh yeah so for clothes um this is kind of like my closet I have had more over there but um we kind of use this as like a model for the space I'll have at school so I've like um, like about this much of hanging space a little less and then three drawers and um, like a shoe rack I'm not gonna bring all those shoes. Those are just like a lot of my shoes that I have but um, And then I'm gonna pick from my bathing suits because I'll bring like one or two bathing suits, but That's basically what we're working with. I also have to pick out some sweatshirt, but yeah uh, How I organized it was I have like bottoms here It's really unorganized underwear socks here and then like all my workout stuff down here. So we're gonna figure this out and yeah, let's watch it happen. So this is kind of like all the hanging stuff and we're gonna go through it, fold it and put it into one of these big suitcases. So yeah, 
<laughs> That's the plan. And then we'll get all of the stuff that wasn't hanging and do the same thing. This suitcase is gonna be like all the stuff I'm gonna wear during move-in for the next week. Um, so just like some light summer stuff, but I don't wanna have to dig through my huge suitcases to find all that. Uh, we're like, we're getting there with this suitcase. I put all my like sweaters and I'm gonna put more sweatshirts in this suitcase, like big bulky stuff and then some dresses. So yeah, and then I just pulled down all these sweatshirts and I'm a little overwhelmed as to how I'm gonna put these all in, but. Let's see, I'm gonna have to go through some and just decide which ones I wanna bring. <laughs> First suitcase is done. <sighs> okay, up to the next one. All right, suitcase number two. Okay, after a quick Annie's Mac and Cheese break, we're back at it and we just have a little bit to finish off. We have all of this, which are like clothes and random socks and underwear. And yeah, so let's get to it, like 20 more minutes. This is what we've done today, which is mostly everything besides uh, worrying about toiletries. So what I did was this is my like week long bag for moving in for the next week. Um, just has like some summary stuff and things I know I'll wear. And then this is like, there's two sides. So I think over there is all like my running, like running clothes and t like cute tops. And then here was um, all my socks and underwear. And then I put shoes on top and then, yeah. And then like a little sweater in there. And then here was a lot of things that are like not clothes related that I'm bringing. And then some swimsuits and that's all hand sanitizer. That's stuff I'm taking on the plane with me. And then this was our big suitcase full of like uh, jeans and big sweaters and coats. And then and we're not bringing those shoes. And then this is the last suitcase that has the last, last of my shoes, which are just like boots and the bags I'm bringing. So yeah, that's it. I love there. Today is Sunday. So meaning we leave in literally two days. It is so soon and I can't believe it honestly. Still really hasn't sunk in that I'm moving, but we only have like a couple last things to do today and then tomorrow I'm dedicating to like not pack at all because it's my last day home. Uh, so we're just gonna do, collect all my toiletries, all my skincare, and I'm definitely a skincare girl so it's gonna be extensive. And um, makeup and all of that. And then also I'm gonna pack my carry-on. And yeah, then we'll just be done. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. I keep dancing with the devil but he doesn't have a back. No, no. So I'll just show you guys what's in this. Okay, so on the left side, I have like a lot of skincare. I have my facial cleanser, moisturizers, body moisturizers, um, like a face mask I really like, a exfoliator, and a um, serum I really like. And then that's those are my face tanning drops I love. And then here I have just some serums and a couple more masks that didn't fit. And then over here is like my teeth and um, just like random stuff like prescription, like stuff like that, toothpaste. Um, razor, random stuff. So that's the first bag and I'm pretty proud of it. So let's do like all the makeup and hair and all that stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching. I think I'm gonna wrap it up there because we're basically like almost completely packed at this point and literally in less than 48 hours, I'll be on a plane and I will definitely pick up the vlog once we start moving because I'll post a whole move-in series um, next week. So this vlog will go up on Wednesday and the next Wednesday I expect a move-in vlog of everything that went down from the plane ride to Ann Arbor all the way until moving in and decorating my dorm. So I can't wait to share that with you guys. But thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe if you love this content and comment down below any questions you may have about the college movement process or anything about that. So thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.